Faith City High School. I'm Faith Brody. And I'm Ken Garcia. Today is Friday, April 16th, and it's National, National Orchid, Orchid Day. Day. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance, followed by the Texas Pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. And now for the Texas Pledge. Honor the Texas flag. I pledge allegiance to the Texas, one state, under God, one and indivisible. Please have a seat for a moment of silence. Today for lunch we'll be having your choice of steak fingers or chicken tenders. All senior members of NTHS Honor Cords are $15. If you would like to purchase one, please bring your money to Miss Watson in room A230. Mornings only by Friday, April 27th. Thanks. Auditions for the Bay City High School Show Choir are Friday, April 27th from 4 to 6 p.m. in the choir room. If you want to be a part of this award-winning group, come by the choir room to pick up an audition pack and get information from Dr. Coward. Packets will be available starting April 18th and must be turned in by April 25th. Prom tickets are on sale. Make sure to get all uniforms and school inventory turned back in and pay any late fines so you can purchase or receive your prom ticket. All late equipment and school funds must be paid. Tickets are $20 for everyone except seniors. Your tickets are free. Last day to get tickets April 18th at 3 p.m. BCHS flag runner positions are filling up fast. There are only three positions open. Please turn in applications on or before April 20th to Ms. Ramos in A211. Pick up an application in student services. Your SAT award of the day brought to you by AVID is Venery, meaning to adore, to honor, to respect. In traditional Confucian society, the young venerate the older members of their village. Well, that's it for today, Black Cats. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you back tomorrow. Have a not so moderate Monday. Or not. The choice is yours. This is Faith. And I'm Kane. And don't forget, it's, it's a, a great, great day, day to be a Black Cat. cat. What subject do you teach? I currently teach Forensic Science and Biology 1. What's one of the most memorable things you've experienced as a teacher? Well, I wouldn't say there's one thing. I would say there's two things. In biology, I would say is that, you know, thanks to Region 3, Ms. Mosier, Ms. Corman, Ms. Hicks, Ms. Lowry, I think we've teamed up and figured out how to make sure that biology kids are successful on the EOC. Our goal is not just for them to pass this year, but actually move them up a level uh, compared to the benchmark. And I think we're being very successful in that. And last year we had really good numbers. As far as forensic goes, I think that the most successful thing I, or memorable thing I've done with that is encouraged a lot of kids to actually go into the criminal justice field and encourage them to go into FBI. Because with FBI, those are lifetime jobs, federal jobs with benefits and you know all the perks and you can almost be anything and be part of a forensic team. How many years have you been teaching? I've actually only been teaching at the school level for this is my second year but I have a lot of experience teaching lesson planning because I actually used to own my own schools for two years one in Bay City and one in Wharton so the classroom environment and stuff it's not something new to me it's just something that I've always wanted to go full circle and teach in a classroom. What do you do in your free time? Uh, I think I do everything but sleep. <laughs> uh, I own an insurance company. I own Derek Logan Insurance Services, and I also have an auctions license. So we also do car dealership, you know, selling of vehicles. And then, of course, I'm a mother, so handling the personal success of my children. But I think the thing that's most time consuming than the insurance company or anything that I do is I spend a lot more time doing lesson plans and making sure my kids are successful. Okay. What is it that you love so much about forensic science? Well, I always knew that the law and forensic science was, it's always been my love. You know, my, my degree is criminal justice with a minor in sociology and my master's is criminal uh, sociology with an emphasis in criminology. And I'm actually gonna start my law degree in August. Mm -hmm. And what I love about it is that hopefully one day I can do it like at the most legal level. My goal is to convert my insurance company to insurance company slash law firm. Or my ideal job would be an actual F, uh, to be an, an attorney for the FBI. Thank you, Ms. Jones.